Welcome to The Power of Rhythm, a podcast with your host, Reinhard Flattischler, founder of Mega Drums, Takatina Symphonic, and a worldwide network of groundbreaking rhythm training. This podcast will offer you an incredible diversity of voices around the one thing that connects us all. Rhythm. Hi and welcome to episode 30 of my podcast. It is a great honor to welcome today one of the true grand masters. He has been born in Thailand and with just six years old, Buddhist monks taught him how to sit and still the mind. Soon he was taught by an incredible number of masters such as Master Lu for Tai Chi Chuan. Master Pan Yu taught him to exchange the yin and yang power between man and woman and how to develop the steel body and the list goes on, but it doesn't even stop there. In order to understand mechanisms of healing energy, he studied Western anatomy and medical science. He is the creator of the universal healing Tao system and he has taught several hundred thousand peoples around the world. Welcome. Master Chia. Hi, <laughs> thank you, Reinhardt. <laughs> thank you so much for being here. I have followed your work a long time. I've read a lot of your books. I have seen a lot of your videos and it's amazing. Now, I want to start there. So many people are now desperate with the lockdowns and so on. And you have such a great method. Forgive, forget, let go. How can one practice that? You know, the first thing is that people are too much worried. So the Tao said, first thing, turn inwardly. And the way to turn inwardly is you close your eyes, get a smile in your eyes, lift up your, your mouth and smile inwardly and picture your heart all love, joy, happiness. We have so many statues, so many churches, temples, but we don't go into ourselves. As Bible says, our body is the temple of God. Yeah. So the first thing that Tao talks about, very simple, very easy. You turn in early and you hold the image of the heart. If you believe you have the heart, <laughs> that's all. And you believe that the heart and every system, every people talk about the heart, store love, Joy, happy, peace, calm. If you want this, go into your heart. Because mm -hmm. we keep on looking outside, you only see more problem, more, exactly. more yeah. emotional, more stress, more, oh, so many things. The world. So when you turn inwardly, smile to the heart, hold your hand and smile and pick to the heart and feel the love, joy, happiness coming out. If you smile to the heart, you feel love, joy, happiness. And you read it now to organ by organ. So the first thing is get your inside peace. Now you started to not think too much. That is the key. Yes. And the idea of smile, the inner smile is so a great picture. Everyone can do that, right? And you have yes. actually... Anybody, because mm -hmm. when you're happy, you smile. <laughs> now when you <laughs> smile outside, why don't we smile inside? <laughs> you have actually connected all the organs to different emotions. Can you explain this to our listeners? Heart, all love, joy, happiness, hatred, impatience. Mm -hmm. If you have too much hatred, impatience, happiness, you have very little love. But if you raise the love and not try to get rid of hatred, impatience, happiness, you raise the love to balancing with hatred, impatience, happiness, when they find a balance, mm -hmm. it's okay. <laughs> you don't have to get rid of it. <laughs> the thing is that if you cannot fight your enemy, what do you do? Yeah. Draw your enemy. Because Balancing it. Yeah, everything now, is yin yang, heart. right? Yeah. Yin yang, yin yeah. yang. If yin yang balance, everything moves. But if you get, you get, I want to be the only holy man in the world. No way. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I don't know how many holy men we have. <laughs> And in the history, we have many billion people. How many holy men we have? Try to find a balance. 
Right. You can get angry, you can hate people, but you have love to balance it. That's it. So in the Tao said, fling pancakes in the right hand side. So you smile, you fling worry, anxiety, and mistrust. Mm-hmm. But if you're balancing them with openness, fair, and trusting energy, now you're balanced. Harmony is the key. Okay. How can we, how can we live together? <laughs> Master now, Jia, where, the, where do you start? With which organ shall someone start? Always start with the heart because mm-hmm. the heart can be shining and radiant. Always start with the heart. If you can get love, joy, happiness, or whatever you want, <laughs> <laughs> right? You're attracting, you know? When you have love, joy, happiness, gratefulness, you're attracting energy, good energy. And even negative, you have enough positive imbalance. The whole key, you cannot get rid of all the bad bacteria in the earth. Only want to cultivate good bacteria. Mm-hmm. It's not going to grow anything. No. We call pH balance. Mm-hmm. It's pH balance. It's very simple. Why we, under- why we don't understand this simple thing? And you say that we can give the negative emotion grounding and to the, to the earth. And the earth takes it, right? They need to have this yes. emotional compost, right? Right. The whole key is that sometimes we have too much and we're hard to handle. So the Tao says, if you just have to remember one simple word, organic garbage. Organic garbage, what do you have to do? Put back to the earth. But people need to learn how to connect in with the earth. We are so floating around. We are not grounded. So in a practice, you have to learn how to simple connecting with the earth. We need connecting with it. So you have to learn how to connect with the earth and you can let go of your negative emotional and the negative emotional will be composed by the mother earth and it gives back us a good energy. All the gold, silver, diamond come from the earth. You ask for the heaven. Heaven don't have gold, don't have a diamond, don't have it. The earth have it. Mm-hmm. So the Tao say, hey, so simple, connect with the earth and the earth gives you health. And wealth, money, fortune, blessing. Earth mm-hmm. and heaven always connect. So look for the earth and it will connect into the heaven. So actually, all the organs, they have different sounds in, the, in your Tao system, right? That you can stimulate yes. them. That can you reach them and can heal them or can clean them. Future world is a technology. It's mm-hmm. not a belief. Okay. In the Tao state, every organ have a sound. Mm-hmm. Like uh, a vibration. Actually, sound is a vibration. Like the heart. This sound has so many things. We call the original vibration of the heart. When the vibration in the heart get wrong, now the heart beats a different. It's so hot. When mm-hmm. we think so much, very busy, very stressed, very emotional, the heart beats very fast. So when you do the sound, you calm the heart. Now the heart goes back into a calm state. Ho. Like when you're very ho. cold. Mm-hmm. Ho. Okay. And you feel hot coming out. <laughs> and that is the heat. The heart has so many fire. I see you start with the kidney, which is water, right? Now always like to start with the heart first. Because uh-huh. the fire mm-hmm. moves everything. The fire burn, the heart fire burn in creating earth. Because the ashes creating uh-huh. earth. And that is the spleen, pancreas, stomach. The big earth, you dig down, you find metal. Mm-hmm. And the metal attract water. And it's creating water and that's the kidney. Uh-huh. And the kidney put on the tree, the liver. The liver grow. And, and, and the tree grow. And now when you have tree, you put on the fire. Uh-huh. It burn to be fire. And now a circle. If you make your organ in the creation, they give birth to each other and they have a relationship. But now we have a counter act cycle. Mm-hmm. The fire melt the metal, the metal act cut the tree, and the tree colluding the earth, the earth block the water. Now, this is what the West always talking now, fire fact, <laughs> mm-hmm. fire fact. And we are creating more counter act. Mm-hmm. This medicine heal the heart, will hurt the lung. Okay. Or the kidney medicine will hurt the heart because water, kidney is water, heart is fire, 
if you have a lot of water and very little fire, now the fire extinguish the heart fire. A lot of medicine in the kidney hurt the heart. Mm-hmm. And this is a side effect that the Western now they have to put in a website, in the internet, tell everybody, hey, if you take this one, liver always going to hurt the digestion, the spleen. Because liver counteract the earth. The wood counteract the earth. Mm-hmm. So a lot of side effects. So in the Tao say, if you want to change your life, so simple. Make sure the organ works as a team. Mm-hmm. Each yeah. one keep birth to each one, each one take care, each one in the creating cycle. And when you get the creating cycle, now <laughs> what do you worry about? You have all the power in your life. You know what? You can attract more money, more joy, more happy, more people come to hell. But when you are so angry, so sick, oh, you repel everything. You don't have the attraction power. Master Chia, who uh, gave you the knowledge of these uh, sounds? Where do the sounds come from? Like the, the Tao tradition of many thousand years. When you do the Tao, you get the organ back to much better vibration. Mm-hmm. That is the key. Okay. When you do the Tao, you actually put the organ into a right vibration. And now organ getting better. And when you do it in the smile, in the creating cycle, now organ very happy, they work as a team. <laughs> All the problem in the world is conflict, internal conflict. Internal conflict come from where? Come from the organ. Organ fighting is harder. And, and you always smile into every organ you smile. Yes, every day you have to do it. You have no way, if you are happy, if you make yourself happy, nobody can make you angry. <laughs> nobody can make you stress. Emotional drain organ. Mm-hmm. That's all. Absolutely. That sounds very, very holistic. And I think it's the future for any medicine. You know, tell us about the dark room project that you have in your Tao Gardens running. You're bringing the people into a dark environment for a week or so, right? Yes. Now, <laughs> actually, on this Saturday, we start the whole dark room trip. So darkness in the in the universe actually is light. That's all. Mm-hmm. So the whole universe is darkness. When at night, if there are no sun and no star, the whole sky is dark because the whole universe is darkness. Mm-hmm. But within darkness, there are light. So the whole darkness is light. So mm-hmm. when you go to the darkness, so you are so calm, so quiet, and you see light. That's all. Now, because light creating us. <laughs> creating the universe, creating the material with the, we call dark matter and dark energy. Yeah. So okay. in the darkness, you see light. Now, is it also uh, a stimulation for the pineal gland? Because the pineal gland is the one that uh, transfers melatonin to serotonin, and it also is connected with the stimulation of the third eye, right? The whole key is that darkness, you're also producing melatonin. Yeah. If you have enough sleep, um, the melatonin produced, in the daytime, it convert to melatonin. Yeah. That's it. So these two chemicals we need. But in order to move to another part, we call the 5-E-M-O, is division. Mm-hmm. And that's why when people take drugs, They see vision, see color, see music. They see all kind of vision. Or if you all train about angel coming in, and now you see angel coming in. So we call hallucination. A DM, okay. It's DMT. It's, DMT. It's, it's natural DMT, yeah? Huh? Not yet. Not yet DMT. 5 mo is a one XD vision. Okay. See color, hear music. You think you travel. You think everything. Now. If you in the dark room enough, you accumulate enough melatonin, and it turn to uh, 5 mo. And now, when you stay longer enough, now you it turn to DMT. DMT oh. is our body traveling. You are traveling out. You have a yin body go out or yang body go out. Yin body where everybody can. You can just sit there and illusion, and you think you do here and here, and that is the yin body. Yin body is very easy to get lost, very easy to mm-hmm. catch any uh, evil spirit that want your energy. The Tao always want to make sure that 
in creating a young body that has enough content energy. So the DMT is separate, we call death. The DMT usually we call death, mm-hmm. death hormone. Yeah. But in the Tao, we don't talk about death. We talk about separation. You call the pineal gland a second sexual organ. Yes, because because when we have orgasm in the in the sexual organ, and the pineal gland is an, is over opposite. If you are male, your sexual organ is male, and the pineal gland become a female organ. The, the whole key in this world, in the spiritual world, is having sex. <laughs> is that I want the reunion with God. It's an easy if you want to have sex with God. So uh, a lot of people think uh, control is not a, such a good thing, but I think control is very important in any spiritual path. And you have refined very much how to control ejaculation and how to control with the contraction, not to ejaculate, but have an orgasm and even have a brain orgasm. So the whole key is not, not ejaculation. The whole key is transforming the sexual Yes. So orgasm and ejaculation are two different things. Make love and you have a lot of orgasm without ejaculation, bring it into the organ. And now the organ receives this orgasm. So you could have orgasm in the organ. You can have an orgasm in the brain, right? Yes. And that is the key. <laughs> <laughs> the DNA renewal needs arousal, orgasm, love, and compassion. And Could you actually explain to our listeners, especially the male listeners, how can they start to control their arousal and their ejaculation? How do we start with that? The whole key they have to understand an orgasm everybody needs. Every single living thing needs. All the animals they need because it's a cycle of having baby. Men different. Men is always having producing sperm in order to get ready. When the lady gets the egg mature and coming down, bang, you only have 24 hours. That's all <laughs> to get the lady pregnant. Mm-hmm. So the the, the nature don't know when the lady get ready, so they always give men a lot of ready energy to have sex. And that's what the Tao have the formula E equal MC squared long time ago. Mm-hmm. You have the sperm and you have the fire, and that we call the speed of light. Mm-hmm. The light, the, we call the, the alchemy fire, light in the universe, or we call the holy fire. Yeah. So the practice is like if someone here listens to that and say, wow, uh, I can have an orgasm, but I don't have to ejaculate. How do I go there? Do you have any first The, the thing, thing is that you have to twin because it's so simple to say one word, have orgasm without ejaculation. But how to do it and technology, that is the key. So you have a practice. So the practice is the first thing you have to understand. So material into immaterial energy, and that is cheap energy. How does Tao deal with music or rhythm or sound? Is there some practice in that or? Yeah, we have, uh, we have, uh, the Tao of music is, I think is so much. In China, I'm not expert in that, mm-hmm. but we use a chanting. We use the pakwa, the yi jin pakwa. Uh, yes, I know. The yin yang, yin yang, and the kwa, and the eight forces chanting. Chanting like singing. And they have uh, a tone. Every organ, uh, every the universe, the material, everything have a tone, oh. have a frequency. Mm-hmm. Okay and have a music frequency. Oh. And every music frequency, we know it, it's affecting us. This music is for your heart, this music for the liver, this music for your kidney, this music for this. So they are very emphasized in that. Yeah. So you said when you activate the two eyes and the third eye together, you have primordial force. You can connect to... Yeah. The, the whole key is that the, now they say the left eye is 
is the sun, the right eye is the moon, oh, and the okay. third middle is the star. So we call two luminance in the sky can okay. capture light. That's all. Wow. It, you have to make sure the light is very fast. <laughs> mm. The light is very fast. It's faster than everything. But our thought and mind when you train is faster than light. <laughs> so it's faster than light. When you practice in the, in, in the dark room, I guide you to practice to see light. Is the pineal gland responsible for the brain orgasm? Yes. Mm. And it's connected to the third eye as well, right? Yes. Yeah. Because the pineal gland is, um, we call the gland of yin yang. That is a, that is a whole process. Capture the light, fixing a light inside you is another thing. Mixing with the light with another uh, alchemy is another thing. So that is a whole inner alchemy practice. Because in music, the space is a very big thing. You know, you people mostly think about the events, but what makes it really groove is the space between. And in the emptiness, there's everything. So if you are really going deep in music, you're always dealing with space. So what's the connection between space and light? You know, the, that is recorded, the true sound. You, so you, the, the first step, you have to train yourself to capture the sound. It's a universal sound. Mm -hmm. We call it the true sound. Mm -hmm. And the universe have sound, but we don't hear them. But the earth producing very noisy sound, but the sound is too high frequency, you cannot hear them. The, the, the frequency of the, all the star, all the planet move is so loud. Okay, but our physical ear cannot hear it. Yeah. So the first thing you have to opening your ear, the throat and the mid eyebrow, mm -hmm. and capture the sound through the ear eardrum, okay, and the ear canal. The true sound activate your heartbeat, make mm -hmm. your brain active and move and thinking, and that is a true sound. No true sound, nothing move. <laughs> no sound, nothing can move. And they even have a love song of the DNA, a love song of the cell when they make love. They, they, they make a sound. And the true sound are different from normal sound. How do you guide someone to capture sound, the true sound? Well, that is, um, the first step is you have to be quiet. Yes. And turn inward. We have to be first thing, the Tantian. The Tantian have to have enough chi and power. And when you have enough energy, you extend your ear out. And now you have to separate normal sound and the true sound. The true sound is too high. Unless you have enough chi to capture that. And you have to distinguish the ordinary sound with the true sound. You know? Then you're connected to the whole universe with that, in a way. Yes. Well... Thank you so much for coming on and giving us all yeah. these precious things. I hope I yeah. can uh, have you many times more on. There's so much to talk about. <laughs> and I, <laughs> Yeah, the, the people, if they're interesting, they can go to mengtechia.com. So uh, when they actually uh, want to connect you, then they give uh, just Mantak Chia, everyone. I mean, if I just put in Mantak Chia, I, get, I, I give a m millions of, of results, you know. But yeah, yeah. to go to the... You just type Mantak and uh, you're connecting to everything, to, to the teaching, to the mm -hmm. online, to the book, to the um, video, to online, everything information everything okay it's a real honor that you were here i hope we see many times thank you. again and i wish you all yeah. the best and thank you for your teaching so much thank you thank you i hope it's work now <laughs> it work, it work. i don't know what today is yeah, yeah. but anyhow you're, you're very good you genius you change it you make it happen <laughs> thank you so much okay thank you thank you thank you